Let's go. Um, we got an elevator to the right. Lock door. This tower is very blue. Looks like this elevator won't budge. Damn, is there some way we can go up? Calm down, Law. We should thoroughly search this floor to see if there are any leads. She's right. For all we know, we might find a way to turn the elevator back on. Hey, open door. And a force field. This looks like some kind of wall. No getting past here, it seems. Probably meant to keep intruders like us out. Gannabelle definitely ain't making this easy. Guess we'll have to find another way around. Move out of the way. I can bust open a wall like this, no problem. Just watch. <clears throat> CPU use. Yep. Tear down this wall. <sighs> you look like exhausted, Law. You feeling okay? Yeah, nothing I can't handle. Let's keep moving. The small door costs more than the big door. This place looks completely different from Balsif's castle. Every lord has their tastes. Whether this really suits my sensibilities is... Another matter altogether. I had to put that on somebody during that it's boss fight. Who built this this guy uses, like, know. light, um... How would we know what Renan's like? Magic. Who cares? Let's hurry up and... Little help! A blip up. Right, here goes. Yeah. Here I come. Eat yeah. 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 it. Take this weekend. Fire support. This is a new one. Put that gun in your hand. Supreme Alpha. Crumble. Necro. You escape. Be still. It's over. Looks like we won. Hey! Wait, I'm not your enemy. I'm with the Silver Swords. I take it you're on our side too, yeah? I infiltrated the Snake Eyes to look information to them. Is there anything I can do to help? Hmm. Looking for a way to activate the elevator. Sorry. Can't say I've heard of anything about that. I don't know if it'll help, but let me tell you about the office you'll find directly across from the entrance. From what I know, there's supposed to be a device attached to a desk that'll open up a door to the block on the end of the compound. Yes. The collection room is here is probably locked, unfortunately, but there should still be a spare key you can use somewhere in this block. Hopefully it'll help you get that elevator online again somehow. Okay. What the 
hell is this? A key. You're done. Well then, let's keep moving. Do I want to go in here? Oh, this is the keys for this room. Say you quickly move the people. All right, that's of Iron Fists. I'm practically unstoppable. What is this place? Some kind of armory? Looks like they're more for decorative purposes than actual combat. Does it matter? We've got a job to do. Wait, this isn't Renan. It's Danon. Really? And not just this one either. All of these. It's all Danon gear. What's Danon equipment doing on display inside a Renan castle? Ask around later if you're so interested. But for now, we've got more pressing matters to attend to. Remember? Sure enough, you found a button under the desk. Press it, yes. All right, unlock Did door. Open the door. We still don't know how to activate the elevator. What's it? Like in the uh, song the here. That bastard, giving us the one round. Track has been excellent so far.
Be my guest. It's over. Fire support. Here I come. Say no more. Our work is done here. Let's move. I'm right behind you, Shion. To the basement we go. They keep a Zugo locked up down here? Why? I've heard rumors that they feed prisoners to one instead of executing them. Do you think? Stop it! Should we fight it? Let's do it. Ah, it's locked. You guys want to come to life already, or what? You know, wait till I open the chest, huh? I guess we can okay. It's better be worth it. Life bottle. Um, how do I use it? Oh, he's got one health, all right, that's fine. Wait, did she not use it? Look like an elevator key to you guys. Only one way to find out. Let's go. Wonder if I can come back here and get the key.
Alright, key to go up one floor. Yay. Do you sense one of your friends, Noodle? Hmm. Are you still thinking about that armory with all the Dan and equipment? Yeah, especially that black armor. I don't think I've ever seen anything from Dana that looked so nice. I can tell you that it was definitely Danon. It was made using techniques found only here. That's how I know. But, ever since the Renans came, our civilization's been scrubbed out, bit by bit. Hardly anything's left now, which is why most people don't remember. But why would the Renans have something like that? Unless... It was the spoils of war. It must be a token of the Danans who fought and lost in the past. Or rather, that the Renans were able to beat them. Armor that nice? Must have been worn by a commander of some sort. They might have even been a Danan hero. A hero, huh? A fallen hero, maybe. I hate to see all that stuff fall into Renan hands. But it's amazing to see that so much of it has survived. You into this kind of stuff then, Rinwell? Uh, I mean, yeah, I guess. Are we done here? We don't want to keep Ganabelt waiting any longer. Alright, um, wow. Give me one second, let's go open my door for my dog. Crap, this elevator's stuck too. I'm sure if we look around this floor, we'll find a key or something that can help.
I'm running out of CP. Mini blouse. Whoops. Equipment. Very nice. Looks nice and tough. healing. Great. Now we can keep moving. Don't overdo it, Law. Useful? Nice. Um, I need a you. That one's gonna be CP again too. I think it's the higher one for the orange. Yeah. Inferno! 
Yeah, this guy's got a lot of health. Powered on. You think the elevator's activated now? Should be. Let's check and find out. Ah. We're coming for you, Janabelt. Where's that damn owl? <laughs> there you are. Your devil horns. <laughs> Bull horns. <laughs> This guy's blocking it. And another red guy. Out of our way. All right. Sick ass Cabo, though. These bad guys really don't mess around. Just a little farther and we'll be there. I'm coming for you. Oh, Get shit. Built. Were there already? Hey, hold up a sec, guys. What's up? We need to talk about Ganabelt. This guy can control both light and lightning, and I've heard his swordsmanship is unrivaled. I'm not surprised. He is one of the top lords, after all. That's not all. He also has these weird little gadgets that he likes to use. 
gadgets. You mean like some kind of a Renin weapon? Probably. He's got a bunch of these things that hover all around him. They're supposed to protect him from attacks coming in at any angle. I take it there aren't any blind spots then? Nope. Which is why I plan to bust down his defenses from the front. What? Why? Isn't that where his defense will be the toughest? That's why it's worth attacking. Once I poke a hole in that bastard's defenses, the rest of you can tear it wide open and give him hell. All right. We go with your plan, Law. Now let's get going. It's about time we got revenge for Zephyr. Here, I thought there was going to be a fucking item guy here. Like the shop, dude. So I could forge my weapons, but he's fucking not. Great. In that case, I can heal. And then... Let me put... This one on you. Let's go fuck this dude up. It's about time. I was beginning to worry you'd jump ship like the rats you are. You're not so fortunate. We're here to end you. To liberate Cislodia. To avenge Zephyr. <laughs> you talk big, but don't you think you're forgetting something? Of your precious resistance groups, whether the Silver Swords or any others, none have ever dealt a blow to Renan domination. In each and every realm, the story is the same. Until you... You, who wields the blazing sword of Calaglia, are different. News of Balsef's defeat really took the wind out of your sails. <laughs> that brute? A bad case of brawn over brain. Certainly no loss to me. Still, even the smallest of sparks can grow into an inferno. I must give precedence to the task at hand, extinguishing you. Snuffing out your fire before it spreads across the five realms. Rinwell? N nothing <coughs> I'm fine. Ah, Ganabelt Valkyris, Lord of Cislodia, accept your challenge. Come and meet your death. You'll pay for what you did to my father! <laughs> the feisty mouth which is to bite the hand that feeds, does he? I never wanted to serve you! I had no choice! Oh shit. <coughs> Where did I get all that damage from? Oh shit, that's how it came. Scarlet Inferno! 
So I don't think I'm gonna be able to stall that at all. Sleep now. It's over. It's too much. 
Oh my god. Out of orange jail. Significant work. Um, now return to dust. Drink deep. Oh, come on. I, who am united with the Maybe he's just gonna cast it again. I'm gonna I have plenty of time to kill him. Refuse to believe this. It cannot end this way. If I die, my subjects will. Hey, the sun's out. Ah, the light is bright. Focus on the positive. We defeated a lord, and under difficult circumstances, too. Focus on the positive? Zephyr's dead, Shion. And the Renans ruled this world unimpeded for three centuries. Did you think there wouldn't be any sacrifices? So Zephyr's life just doesn't matter? He's dead, Shion. 
Our friend is dead. We're fighting this damn war to keep people alive. <sighs> yeah, you're right. This is a war. Did you just realize that? Zephyr wasn't the first to die, and he sure won't be the last. If you can't handle that, Alfin, then you should run back to Calaglia. And when you do, just remember to leave the Blazing Sword here, in safer hands. What's that supposed to mean? <sighs> Damn it. She just thinks she can say whatever she likes. Bickering among ourselves at a time like this isn't gonna get us anywhere. Especially at a time like this. <sighs> All right. Fine. So much for Ganabelt. Good riddance. You said it. So, was the Lord of Calaglia like Ganabelt too? No. Falsef was huge, a real tough guy act. Now that I think of it, his crest was different too. His was a flaming cross. Ah. I see. Uh, anyway, what do you guys plan on doing from here? We keep moving. Three Renan Lords remain, and we won't rest until their thrones are empty as well. That work for you, Xion? That was my endgame from the beginning. Uh, hey, so if it's not too much trouble, could I maybe come along? Isn't Cislodia your home? I mean, yes, but... It's just, now that everyone knows what I've been hiding, well, it might be best to get as far away as I can until it all quiets down. Is that okay? I promise I'll pull my own weight. Sure. You're welcome to join us. Taking off, huh? Yeah. Thanks for everything. It's too bad. I wish there was more we could do to pay you back for all you've done. I'll see to it personally that Zephyr's remains reach Calaglia safely. What's next for Cislodia? I honestly couldn't tell you. The enemy infiltrated its way right to our core as a people. Only time will tell if we can rise above our suspicions and come together. Zephyr once told me that so long as you don't give up, there's no wall that can't be torn down. Sounds about right. And thanks to you, the greatest obstacle that was in our way is now gone. I suppose the rest of it will be up to us. I look forward to seeing how far you'll go. Oh, I almost forgot. Before you head off, there's something I wanted to give you. Hmm? It was a parting gift. It's like speaking to one of the old Danon heroes from legend. Where to next, then? Elda Menencia. You're really going to travel in that thing? Why not? It's not as heavy as it looks. Actually, there's someone I was hoping we could invite along with us. You can't be serious. Some place to be? Not really. I mean, I can't stay here, of course. Then again, there's no one waiting for me back in Calaglia either. 
Plenty of ditches along the road. Maybe I'll find one to die in. How about a fresh start? After the kinds of things I've done, I don't know where I'd even begin. Your father said that as long as you face the past, there's hope. I think it might be a little late for that. He also said he'd fought and lost all his life, but didn't regret it in the slightest. <laughs> it's only over when you give up. Keep fighting, and even that wall inside you can be brought down. Don't you want to see what your dad saw on the other side of that wall? What he was fighting for? Do you... Do you think I'm even worthy to? That's for you to decide. sick of losing everything I love, of running from life. Maybe all that's left is to just turn around and face it. Count me in. Finally. I thought you'd never finish. We've still got a ways to go. Alright, befriended law once again. With the Master Core of Light. This armor was a gift from Bregan. What if it really did belong to a Danon hero once upon a time? He challenged an overwhelmingly powerful Renin foe and perished for it. I wonder how he felt having the hopes of the people riding on him. It is some pretty epic armor. Did you make off with that armor while none of us were looking? Because I've got to admit, you look pretty snazzy in it. He didn't steal it, if that's what you mean. Brecken gave it to him as a parting gift. Ah, right. Although it makes sense, I guess. It's like a symbol of rebellion in its own way. Which is why it should have been your father wearing this, not me. I don't know. I don't think he could have pulled it off like you, man. I wonder what the last wearer of this armor was dreaming of for Cislodia when they decided to rise up and fight. Who knows? Anyone who could have answered that is long gone. Truth is always lost with the departed. Are you saying there's no point in trying to understand why they gave up their lives? No. Only that it's impossible to know for sure. Look, I can tell that you're concerned about Cislodia's future. But we do have other things to take care of. You can't shoulder all of the world's problems, Alfin. If you try to, you'll only find yourself buried by the weight of it all. Yeah, I know. My path is forward, and I'll do what I can, here and now. You were born in Calaglia, right, Law? Hmm? Oh, yeah. It's scalding hot all the time there, so I was shocked when I learned Cislodia is the exact opposite. Not to mention dark. Not anymore, thankfully. How did you even manage to cross the border between realms? All five realms are supposed to be closed off, due to the nature of the crown contest. What? Is this an interrogation now? I didn't mean it like that. I just figured if a Danon like you was able to slip between realms, it could come in handy later. Ah, good thinking. I don't think I really did anything all that creative, though. What? Don't tell me you climbed over the walls of fire. Oh, hell no. Not even Zoogles could do something that crazy. Nah, I stowed away. In what? 
Oh, you'll like this. The realms don't maintain much contact with each other, but there are resources each is looking to trade for. So, there are cargo convoys from each of the lords that go around a few times a year to lend those resources to each other. Oh yeah, I remember hearing about that. That was the only time the gates of Calaglia would ever open up. Right. Obviously, they don't let Danans ride with them, so I snuck on board inside some cargo instead. So you were carried out of the realm? You did great not getting caught. Way to go. Eh, let's just say I've always had a knack for sneaking around since I was little. I was also really desperate to get the hell out of Calaglia at the time. I had more guts than brains that day. If I had a guess, I probably wasn't the first one to ever do something like that. Danon or Renan. I wonder if that's how Menic, I mean, Ganabelt, was able to hear about what happened in Calaglia so quickly. So in other words, we should always assume that the enemy is informed about whatever it is that we may be up to, wherever we go. All right. <sighs> what was I gonna do? I was gonna do something. I forgot what. It's nice too that they show you where the uh, sub quests are. <laughs> 